So you, yes. you know, I understand that you speak from, um, like you look at relationships from the spiritual perspective, right? So yes. how you frame that out in terms of your spirit, you know, your connection spiritually or, and in general, you know, like what the, what's the message around spirituality and relationships? I love that topic. It's a good one. Um, well, it's a little differing and it's a little contradictory to what is standardly out there. Okay. Um, we like that. Yeah, we like that. We like that. <laughs> from the perspective of um, uh, soul partners and whatnot, as is very popular these days, um, it, my information is what I will be sharing with you. So everybody has their own, so take it or leave it. But um, there's really no such thing. And it sounds good, it's very romantic, but really your twin flame soul partner is you. It is your male and female aspect within that is the divine marriage. Yep. In that union is given birth to the divine human, which is the child. And that is the core of all relationships. Does it metaphor into human relationships? Yes, but only metaphor. So to look for someone else or someone else to be that partner is to look outside of yourself and turn away from self. With that model, there is no way for true fulfillment or the true discovery of self because you are externalizing and looking to a metaphor for your divine connection. And it can't be, it would be like marrying a hologram and assuming the hologram was going to fulfill you. It can't, it won't. And that's why there is so much difficulty and so much misunderstanding and so much uh, misinterpretation. And if we focus on the, the divine marriage within, then the human marriage can work in a way that has yet really been recognized on the planet, except for maybe a small handful. And this is a lot of the information that we share because it is all about the relationship with self. And as one phrase that, that is, comes through quite often is, you can only share the love you have with another to the extent you have it for yourself. In the truly divine connected way. And so in this, the male and female union is really where the growth in humanity takes place. 